OCO. I'm Paul Buckner, Interim Executive Director of the Cherokee Heritage Center. Welcome to the 25th Annual Cherokee Homecoming Art Show and Sell Virtual Awards Ceremony. We are proud to celebrate a quarter century of presenting this exhibition that showcases the enormous talent of our Cherokee artists. The Cherokee Homecoming Art Show began in 1995 as a means of fostering the development of traditional arts and heritage in the Cherokee Nation. Over the years, the show has expanded its categories, sponsorship, and professionalism, but it is still here because it never lost the fundamental purpose of supporting the artists expressing our native culture and continuing our mission to preserve, promote, and teach Cherokee history and culture. We would like to thank this year's prize sponsors. We are excited to announce that because of our sponsor support this year, we have over $16,000 in prize money to award. Cherokee Nation Businesses is in its 17th year of supporting the arts with us, and we are proud to partner with them in this endeavor. Additionally, we have an individual award that is sponsored by Rabbit Studios. It's through these sponsorships that we can support Cherokee artists in their work. We would like to thank Junior Miss Cherokee, Desiree Matthews, for joining us earlier this week to present each award-winning piece with the prize ribbons. OCO, I'm Callie Chimstudy, curator for the Cherokee Heritage Center. Thank you for joining us to celebrate the 25th year of this art show that has become a staple in the Cherokee art community. This year's homecoming art show accepted 51 artists and a total of 91 pieces into the show. We would like to thank our judges that painstakingly deliberated and considered each entry carefully to select the most outstanding winners. Al Heron, Cherokee National Treasure for Bow Making. Ashley Holland, Cherokee Citizen, Assistant Curator for the Art Bridges Foundation and former Assistant Curator of the Native, of Native Art at Idle Jordan Museum of American Indians and Western Art. And Heidi Big Knife, Shawnee Citizen, IAIA graduate and award-winning jeweler and metalsmith. What do for your service? One of the special awards each year is the People's Choice Award. That is voted on by you throughout the art show. I encourage you to check out the online gallery on our Facebook page. Each reaction counts as a vote and the winner will be announced after the show is closed. Now for the awards. We'll begin with the beadwork category. Honorable mention goes to Stephanie Duggar for her piece, Dogwood Set. Honorable mention also goes to Footloose by Sally Briggs. First place in beadwork goes to Carolyn Pallet for Woodland Blues. Next is Traditional Arts. Honorable mention goes to Phyllis Jume for Ganula Hi Dega Loda. First place in Traditional Arts for Go Ask Grandpa goes to Cherokee National Treasure Noel Grayson. Jewelry Category. Honorable mention goes to Tony Chaliwa for Grandmother Spider Steals the Sun. First place goes to Tony Chaliwa for Lodge Boy and Thrown Away the Hero Twins. Next is Contemporary Pottery. Honorable mention goes to Turkey Bowl by Bella Smith. First place in contemporary pottery goes to Jenny Wilson for That Cat Mugs. We awarded one prize in our sculpture category and best of that category went to Ernie Poindexter for his fish Next is the textiles category. Honorable mention goes to Jennifer Thiessen for her piece, Ribbon Skirt and Shawl Set.
honorable mention also goes to Tanya Hogner Weevil for her baby dress. And honorable mention for Thankful Morning goes to Lisa Forrest. First place in textiles for Gostaya Adadlost goes to Kedesa Tihi. In our contemporary baskets category, honorable mention goes to Layers by Teresa Million. And first place in contemporary baskets is awarded to Vicki Coppage for Riding the Waves. Our last standard category is Visual Arts. We have six honorable mentions in this category, and they go to Mark Wolf for Negotiation, Linda McCrary, Swimmer School at Adams Corner, Roy Boney Jr., Dragon Canoe Leads an Attack, Deanne McDaniel, Grandfather's Hands, and Kendra Swafford for Dini Lawi. And first place in visual arts goes to G2 Senses and Old Danger by Robin Stockton. There were no entries this year for the categories traditional basketry and traditional pottery. Next is Judges' Choice. We award five Judges' Choice prizes for this show, and the winners are Karen Berry for Ebb and Flow, Carolyn Pallet, Time Ago, a collaboration piece by Candessa Tihi and Kenny Glass titled Kamama. Robin Stockton for Season of the Three Sisters. And last but not least, Yona by Jerry Sutton. Before we announce the grand prize winner, we have a few special awards to announce. The Emerging Artist Awards are sponsored by Cherokee Nation businesses and given for original works in any medium or category from artists who have shown in less than three previous homecoming shows and have not won any previous awards. The awardees are third place in the Emerging Artist category goes to Yolanda Anglin for A Mother's Helper. Second place in Emerging Artists goes to Tribal Tribute by Tiffany Duncan Reader. And first place in Emerging Artists goes to Cherokee Eye by Ray Camiato. The Bill Rabbit Legacy Award is given in honor of Cherokee National Treasure Bill Rabbit and sponsored by Rabbit Studios. Bill was always generous to the Cherokee Heritage Center throughout the years, and his work is permanently on display in our Trail of Tears exhibit. In honor of Bill, we would like to present this award to Kelly Gonzalez for her piece, O Du Ligali. And now for the grand prize award. Along with a ribbon, we have our tradition of presenting the grand prize award winner with a custom-made copper gorget created specifically for us by Cherokee jeweler, 
Tony Chalewe. And the winner is Jennifer Thiessen for her piece, Missing and Murdered Indigenous Women's Dress, Oklahoma Sisters. Congratulations, Jennifer. Congratulations to all of our artists, and thank you all for joining us this evening. Remember, the artwork is for sale. Peruse the online gallery on the Cherokee Heritage Center Facebook page and contact us to arrange your purchase. Why don't?